vloggy vlog. We're headed to the doctor. I gotta get some love work done. And I'm actually running <coughs> about eight minutes behind. Um, stretch let me show y'all my outfit real quick i got this um i told y'all i got this hoodie from well i bought it on a, another vlog from target and it just says black bold and bougie which is so freaking cute um i have i have the tag i have the tag in my room about uh, for the designer who made it i have to go look at it but it's from target and of course you get it during the Black History Month um, when they have all the highlighted black stuff in Target. But anyway. Um, oh, and then the pants. My bad. And then the pants are the same corduroy pants from New York and Company. So I just paired these together and we have an outfit. So, yeah, I was... Y'all, one of the... My feet be dragging in these house shoes. I know it's so annoying. One of the most... Look at that balloon still hanging for dear life. That thing will not deflate. It's from Valentine's Day. But I just grab it and put it out. Right? Trifling. But one thing that really gets me about adulthood is insurance. Like, what do you guys feel like is the biggest scam of being, like, an American? Um, me and the hubs was talking about this early this morning. Oh, no. We were talking about last night. And I was saying insurance property taxes and student loans to me because <sighs> insurance be stressing me out i'm about to um eat a plum because i'm starving this chicken's still good let me see like y'all know i made it on friday we'll say monday it's still good i mean these chicken legs we came from the gym Samantha, why oh, you scare me? We came from the gym this morning and I still haven't ate because I had to go get blood work done and you're supposed to fast before you go get blood work done. Ooh, yeah, so, yeah, so that's where we're at. So I'm gonna just heat up these chicken legs and eat those with a plum and that'll be my little, or should I wait, what time is it? It's 10.30, it's only 10.30 in the morning, y'all, but I'm hungry, I need my protein. I told y'all we're athletes now. I was telling y'all the other vlog, we're athletes now. Um, it'll be all right, right? It's not a big deal. It's just, just chicken legs. Just three chicken legs. We're gonna eat it. So, oop, that lid popped off. I have a new update in my office though. I did, so y'all, I moved these chairs in here. Um, so, I actually moved them because Bray slumber party and I was like, y'all not going to tear up these chairs. So I was like, I put them in my office temporarily, but everybody liked it. And I was like, um, I kind of do like it too. So I was like, why not? So I was like, why not just leave them here for now? We can always switch it back. And it was funny because when I put them in here, me and Mark kind of chilled in here for a few hours because he was sitting here and I was over at my desk and we were just kind of just talking about business and um, all kind of stuff. So I was like, I do like these right here. Um, and it doesn't look too shabby. So let me know what y'all think. I think it's cute. And then of course, um, the agenda is to go get new flowers. The host bought me flowers here, um, but I want to keep them in this cute little, look how cute this face is. The water's dirty, but you get the, you get the point. So I need to go get some. Got chicken on my phone, girl. Ain't that hungry. 
so I want to read my my Bible verse of the day. My friend Nini told me how to turn on the notification to we get the verse of the day. I've had the Bible app forever, and I never knew you could turn on the notification. So I was like, oh, how cool. Verse of the day. Him, we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins, according to the riches of his grace. And that's Ephesians 1 verse 7. And that is awesome. And that is our verse of the day. I like that. Um, I was wondering if we had like the same verse because sometimes she'll send me some of her verses. And I was like, well, let me read mine. And they're the same. But that's all right because ain't nothing wrong with hearing it twice. Okay. Uh, we're done with ch chicken. It was good. Even better season because it got to sit for a few days. Oh, look at these crazy girls. Um, right now we're editing... And I'm debating if I want to go ahead and get out now or if I want to get out a little bit later. Like, maybe I should just go ahead and run. Excuse me. I'm thinking maybe I should, should just go ahead and run some of my errands right now. Because it's already 11.30. And then I can be back on this side of town. Okay, y'all, we have left Ross, and I got some of the things that I needed to get out of there, um, which was I needed two new pillows and just some little house knickknacks, but Ross is like, Ross is my store, and it's just not storing these days. <laughs> like, I don't like going in there at this point, and maybe it's the one that I go to, um, I don't know. It's just like, it's just going downhill. And then their inventory is terrible. Like, there's nothing, nothing, like nothing. I usually find, I didn't even go look at the shirts or anything because I'm really on a shop my closet type deal. So why is my hand like this? But I'm really on a shop my closet type deal. So I really didn't even go look at any shirts or any clothes. Um, but sometimes like I'll come across like a, you know, going to the checkout, you may see like a cute blazer or a cute like top by the brand. Um, it's a brand they have in there. She makes really cute clothes. I can't think what it's called. But, you know, sometimes you may see a cute top or something. But I didn't even, I didn't even want to glance at the clothes. I just got the home stuff that I needed and then we got out of there. Bray's in the back sleep. I don't know if y'all can hear her snoring. I guess she tired. Um, but yeah, so now we are, now we're headed to Walmart. So y'all pray for us. It's, uh, 4.50. Um, so that's kind of where I'm at in my dilemma about even coming to Walmart. Cause I hate the afternoon crowd. Sorry, sorry. I hate the afternoon crowd. And it's not because people are like, oh, Walmart. Like, it's not because it's Walmart. It's because Walmart, the way that they do business as far as their cashiers and these lines, like they're out of line. Like the lines in Walmart are atrocious. It's like, you know, you know how you see the whole debate about Walmart versus Target and all that yada, yada, yada. For me, it's not because it's Walmart. It's just because the lines are disgusting. Like, who wants to wait that long to get in line? It just be nasty. So, and then the only thing they have open is checkout. Like, it's like, do y'all not have any cashiers? Like, and then the checkout line be so long. It's just like, that's my problem with Walmart. It's not because it's Walmart, because I actually like Walmart. Target, you just get a peace of mind. Cause you know that you're not, you know the line's not gonna be bad. You know that stuff is, I guess you could say, a bit more organized and all that good stuff. But I got to go in here and get my contacts. That's the initial reason why I came. Because I ordered my contacts through Walmart and my glasses through Walmart. Um, and then while I'm here, I just need to get some stuff that I'm going to need for Bray's party on Friday. And um, I guess I'll grab like just some little knickknacks while I'm in here. Because, you know, Walmart is... A little bit cheaper than Target and Whole Foods, which is the only two places that I shop. 
um i should i keep trying to get a costco cart yeah i'm, I'm avoid i'm i'm really avoiding going inside this store <laughs> they put a charlie's in here though um i was like ooh, that's nice that's real nice but we're gonna go ahead come on bray bray come on she back her knocked out so yeah let's go ahead and deal with this walmart crowd i really don't want to but i'm gonna go ahead and do it um because I got to. All right, so first things first, I need to go get my contacts because I'm going to be highly upset if I go in here and then I forget my contacts because I'll do some dumb stuff like that. Let's roll. All right, y'all. So we're back from Walmart, obviously. And um, I'm about to plate dinner. I made some honey chipotle chicken bowls. And um, yeah, so I'm just going to... Add in our brown rice. This is the whole grain 365. I like to put it in one bowl first and then I'll allocate where it goes. Hold on. So I can see the portions or eyeball the portions. Um, and then that's that. And then I'm going to add in our chicken. to incorporate vegetables into your dinner a super easy way to incorporate vegetables is to add a spinach saute spinach and you can basically add that to like any meal seriously and it tastes perfectly fine i just got some chicken unless you're childish and you act like you don't like vegetables but other than that I mean, who doesn't love sauteed spinach? So, easy way to incorporate vegetables, especially if you have kids and they haven't ate greens all day. Cilantro to me and Mark's because Ray acts like she don't like cilantro, even though it's delicious. And the last thing I'm gonna do is add a slice of a tomato real quick. Okay, so I chopped up our tomatoes. Now I'm just gonna add them in to our dish. And then the last step to these bowls is to add in, um, you could do a little bit of this creamy, this is a creamy chipotle sauce. And that's how they become the Chipotle bowls. But if you want to skip out on this step, you, I mean, you can, but it just gives it like a little, you know, a little sun sun into it. All right. Bowls. So like I said, this one has cilantro, sauteed spinach, tomatoes, Chipotle, chicken, and brown rice. And yeah, that's it. It doesn't need cheese. Only thing I could add if you want to add like a little bit more calories is uh, black beans. But other than that, voila. Okay, y'all. So it's the next day. We did not close out the vlog last night after we ate. But here's a few of the snacks I got for Bray's party. Um, they're going to have like a candy station, juice. Now, her theme is pink and purple. She doesn't know the color of her theme yet. So yesterday when I was picking out candy and juice and stuff she probably was super confused like why is she picking certain colors like i didn't i didn't try to make it like obvious i was picking certain colors but it was like she would grab one thing i'm like no 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 let's get it in like purple or so she probably was really confused because she really doesn't know what the color of her her summer party is but i made it pink and purple I even got flowers to match because i was so it was some real pretty orange roses and i was like no let's get and she was probably like what is wrong with her why is she so stuck on these two colors but that's why so yeah and then this candle came from ross y'all it smells so freaking good it smells so good if you find it get it but anyways y'all we're gonna go ahead and end this vlog here and um i'm gonna clean up and start organizing some of this stuff for this party and we'll see you guys in the next vlog